I'm having a bit of an I wanna problem. You see, I wanna get out of debt, and I want to keep growing my farm, and I wanna go sell this 26,000 liters of manure at the BGA. But I can, because I don't own it. But we do have a bunch of milk over here, and I wanna sell it all right now. <laughs> we got 118,000 liters of milk in there. That's going good. Um, What's kind of confusing, though, is there's also milk over here. But I'm not sure where the other milk is going or coming from. This has 18,000 in it, which is, I think we would all agree, phenomenal. But why is there milk over there and over here? I don't, I don't know how it's happening. It's just like this milk won't process fast enough. And this one just grows. I don't, I don't know what these cows are doing. It's cool. I just don't know what's going on. But I have other I wanna problems as well. For example, I wanna keep this tractor. I love that tractor. It's working great. I've got another I wanna. I wanna get rid of this tractor because it's working perfectly fine. However, I also wanna keep this tractor because it's stupid big. And I, I don't I don't know what I wanna with that. It the combine works fine. I have no complaints. And I want one of these in real life, but that's beside the point. That was a wall. Here's what I kind of wanna, I guess. Is that the word to use? Use vehicle sales. You know what I'm getting at here. Why is this here? What? Where did this come from? I wanna this right now. Specifically, I wanna this version. <laughs> this one only costs 162,000, but guess what? That's 162,000 I don't have to pay later. Plus, it's 46% off right now. That's a pretty good deal. Now. Taking a look at our money, we've actually done pretty well paying things back. Plus, we made $46,000 overnight on milk. That's pretty good, too. So, I'm just gonna pull a million dollars out of the bank and... <laughs> See? It wanted me to have it. It wouldn't have been in the sell station if it did not want me to have it. Am I right? I'm right. Oh, don't sell it. Uh, we do need to repair it, though. And, uh, and that's all good. Okay, so now we're... Actually, I think we got a little bit more money than we did beforehand, but we've got a nice big old tractor, which is kind of kind of bouncy if I'm, if I'm honest, but it's a lot of fun. So we've actually done pretty decent as far as equipment goes. Uh, we've got, I mean, we started with a 9RX. Now we've got an 8R. So that's pretty good. We've got a 6R over there, not a new one, if, if I'm honest, but I mean... We got two pretty good big tractors now on the cheap. And we just need like a good combine harvester. But as you can see, they ain't one in a, in a, in a thing. It, I ain't got, they ain't one right there. So the manure and slurry is not selling for as good as it possibly could. But you know what? It's all right. And of course, as I mentioned, we've got that 18,000 liters of milk just kind of like chilling out doing i don't know whatever uh, i need to get this over to farm dairy cheaty right now i have no idea how i'm gonna do that i'm on the roof by the way so this is what i'm thinking about right here 82 studios ab tanker trailer that came with the 2020 i thought maybe this could be exactly what we're looking for here so let's use our uh, newfound 8r x t uh, r regular r I don't know my John Deere's very well anymore, I guess. <laughs> oh yeah, doesn't the front of this thing like kneel and stuff? Hey, make that, oh yeah, that's pretty cool. I don't know, I guess I could just kneel all the time. There's really no reason to, to run it any other way. All right, we'll hook up to this. I did try to go with a, a John Deere-esque design. Uh, I did my best, man. I did my best. It's kind of cute hanging out back there though, isn't it, with this massive tractor? Probably should have brought the 6R, but who cares? This is awesome. All right, so we'll bring it here. We'll open her up, and we want the milk. Give me the milk. 18,000 liters. Go, go, go. And we've got that. It was actually giving us a trigger to sell over there, but or at least deposit, but we're not doing that. And then we need to find the trigger for here. So we'll dump that in. We'll double check and make sure that it is going up. And it is. That's good. Man, this thing looks so good. Photo up. Yeah! And now the milk is in there. So we put all 118,000 liters within it. Actually, we don't even need this trailer over here anymore, do we? Actually, we kind of do. So with manure and slurry, I'm not keeping it. I'm getting rid of it. There's no point for me to keep either one of these. So 
Uh, did I spell Gary since that's Gearson's? I spelled that wrong. Is what is what I did. Let's tag that place. Let's go over there. I'm gonna take them some slurry, and uh, and maybe respell their name a little bit more right. All right, we got another problem. Um, this is eighteen thousand liters of milk in it again. Huh? <laughs> uh, let's go up here to milk. Show it eighteen thousand liters in in here and I walk up to it there it is the 18,000 liters that I moved to over here which is now showing 118,000 liters over here I'm not gonna touch the milk again because I'm pretty sure I just duplicated it whatever this setup is this is a milk hack never thought I'd say that in farm sim all right well maybe maybe I will say it all right so Look at this. So I'm I'm pulling the milk out right now. You see, the milk has is completely disappearing from the silo. If a pit pause, it's just not there anymore. It's gone. And I'm gonna bring it over here now. And I'm gonna sell it to this fine gentleman the the, the milk thing right here. Before I get out, look at this. Milk. Ninety-nine thousand I basically removed the milk that was here from, from the thing. And look at this. Now the milk's going up and the milk's going up. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. I'm going to run and hide. I'm going to go under the map. Bye. Look, I'm not saying that I know everything about everything, but I am saying that I don't know anything about what just happened. I need help. And it's back again. I want to go home. <laughs> All right. Well, let's pull the slurry out of here and see if that will automatically duplicate itself man i don't know all right we got it and i've swapped out for something a little bit more size appropriate this looks way better on the back of this tractor versus on the 8r i think it was nuts all right over here at jerry sons and we're gonna change his name up to gary son first and foremost let's sell this first because i don't know what's gonna happen when i change the name nice and easy let's sell some manure and everybody's happy money's going up not not very high not a lot but it is going up all right you know what 3700 bucks not bad that's enough to feed the animals which speaking of yeah they're fine they don't need any food right now what i should do is pay back some of this loan <laughs> yeah let's give the bank back like a hundred grand can you imagine uh going to the bank like every other day being like hey i need a million dollars you need what i'll bring it back like half of it back tomorrow what are you doing with this money don't worry about it. Speaking of don't worry about it, uh, our field's just fine. It's growing, it's fertilized, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, forgot to mention all that earlier. Oh yeah, if you thought that I'm actually gonna sell the 8710, yeah, it's your mind. 7810. Crap, I don't know the name of the tractor. Uh, I love this thing. It sounds good. It drives really good. I mean, it's a, it's got duels on the back. No issues whatsoever. It doesn't move around. Um, and we're going to go ahead and get the manure out of here as well. I got to sell that. No, I love the 7810. Totally called the 7810, and I've never called it anything else ever. All right, so we got a couple different places we could go. Loading Bay 3 or not the BGA sell point. Loading Bay 3 is giving us one more dollar per thousand liters, and, well, I think that's what we may take advantage of, as long as I can get out of here without hitting the totally John Deere, not a Kenzie at all planter. This one might be a little bit tricky to get in here, but I think we can make it happen. So it's that on the far back. I think instead of coming from the left side, I'm gonna come over here from the right side, get as close to this wall as we can, and then get to about right here. Got it! And unload that manure. So we've got them numbered up one, two, three from right to left. 2,900 bucks. You know what? It's more than zero and I'll take it. And if I take you around with me anymore, I'm gonna have to put you to work and I don't think anybody wants that. So join me tomorrow. We're gonna do it again.